All right, this is the video for the parfait, this week's cooking class. Um, you would go ahead and start by simply putting in your name, and you can go ahead and put your first name and your last name. And when you get down here to the video, you click on it, and it will tell you how to make pudding. Now, after you've seen the video, because pudding is one of the first things you need to make, before you combine all the ingredients to create your parfait. You need to pick four food items. Uh, we don't need cooking spray, but pudding mix will help. We don't need ketchup or tortillas, but whipped cream is good. No cinnamon needed. And yes, milk and a jar of cherries complete the ingredients. Very simple recipe. Here are the cooking items needed to combine all this together. A tablespoon, no oven mitt or fork necessary, no dinner knife, but a measuring cup will help. Going down here to the parfait glass, makes it look pretty. No dinner plates or steak knife, but a timer, because it takes about 10 minutes. Moving here to the large mixing bowl to combine all the ingredients, and we do need a whisk. Step one is you pour the pudding, uh, not the fat of the foot, but the pudding mix into the bowl. Number two is you add two cups of milk and mix together with a, not a stick belt or skillet, but a whisk. Step three is you place the pudding in the refrigerator, not the pit, freezer, or the lame-looking bucket here. Step four is when the timer explodes. No, not that one, but when the timer rings, take the pudding out of the refrigerator. Step five, you have two, two spoonfuls of pudding in the bottom of the parfait glass, not the top or not in the hair. Step six, you add a layer of whipped, not puppies, but whipped cream. Lemons, lava, gooey need not apply. Step seven, add another, not dunk or ton, but another layer of pudding. On step eight, you're going to blank another layer of whipped cream. You're going to add it, not fillet or stab it or mix it. Mixing it kind of loses it anyway. Step nine, one, add one more layer of, not dirt, but pudding will taste a lot better. Uh, you don't need a crab or a mix. Step 10 is you add one more layer of crab cream, ice cream, chocolate cream. Mm, that sounds good. Buttercream, yes, but you need whipped cream. The last step is place a, not a turtle or a pillow, but a cherry on top of the whipped cream. No frog needed or even those dastardly cockroaches. Now we're gonna answer some questions. Uh, what did you use the whisk for? And there's a picture of a whisk. You used it to mix the ingredients together. Pretty simple. Even adds a little air as you're mixing it. Which of the parfait ingredients should you keep in the refrigerator? Hmm, well the whipped cream is one, milk is the other, but you should also put the cherries in there once you've cracked open the jar. Uh, otherwise, they may go bad. There's a lot of sugar and preservatives in that. Uh, the next uh, question is, what parfait ingredients do you need, do not need to be kept in the fridge? I think that's pretty easy. The pudding mix does not need to be kept in the fridge, at least until you've used it and created the pudding. Um, the next step is, how long do you wait for the pudding to set? Here, it states 10 minutes. What are three words that describe a cherry? Well, you can pick any three you want. I put red, sweet, and juicy. How are milk and whipped cream the same? Well, they're both the same color, white. You can go as simple as that, or you can go more complex. How are milk and whipped cream different? Well, one is liquid, and the other is thicker. What part of a meal would you eat a parfait for? I don't know about you, but I would eat it for dessert. Do you like to eat pudding or whipped cream more? Which do you like? I prefer whipped cream, and I think a lot of you guys do too. And what are two other pudding flavors you could use to make a parfait? Banana or lemon drop, if you just kind of look in the picture, even mocha is there. When you're done, you click submit, and if everything's been done correctly, you're going to get this response. All right. 